is known as the best ingredient, but please stop using it during pregnancy because it can interfere with fetal growth. Hello, I'm K-Beauty Ambassador Hedy for your flawless skin. Today, I'm here to talk about pregnant women's skin health. Many mothers-to-be do get depressed as hormones fluctuate and that causes various skin problems. However, with all those skin concerns, they still hesitate to use cosmetics as those might affect their babies. So, here I am to tell you how to take care of pregnant women's skin and why you should watch out for you and your baby. During pregnancy, the female hormone estrogen rapidly changes and melanin cells are activated. As a result, the skin color of the papilla, armpit, and the pregnancy line of the stomach gets darker and you get a lot of spots and blemishes on your skin. Also, you can become more sensitive to external stimuli, making your skin sensitive and developing acne. In particular, the weight increases rapidly and the skin of the belly is greatly expanded, so many pregnant women also have problems with elasticity and stretchy skin. From now on, let's find out the ingredients that are safe both for babies and mothers to be and essential skincare methods. One of the most stressful skin concerns during pregnancy is the dullness and growing age spots. For those concerns, try vitamin C products. Vitamin C not only controls melanin cells, but also cares for skin aging concerns that become dry due to antioxidant effects. However, choose a product that contains pure vitamin C that is less irritating to the skin. The rapid change in hormones activates a lot of melanin cells, where exposure to ultraviolet rays can activate more melanin cells and spread spots faster. Therefore, sunscreen is a must. However, for sensitive skin, I recommend you to choose mild physical sunscreen. When pregnant, nutrients can be concentrated on the baby, weakening your skin barrier and deepening dry skin concerns. The key ingredient that strengthens the skin barrier. Apply moisturizing products containing pellagrin and ceramide from time to time to moisturize the barrier. When you get pregnant, you gain weight and get stretch marks. So make sure you apply a moisturizing body lotion, massage the body from three months of pregnancy to three months after childbirth. And most of all, don't forget to keep doing it even after giving birth to maintain healthy skin. There are many pregnant women who are worried that cosmetics made with dozens of ingredients will affect their babies, right? Since pregnancy is the most sensitive period due to rapid hormonal changes, it is still better not to use products with caution announced by the Ministry of Food and Drug Safety during pregnancy. The first ingredient to watch out for during pregnancy is Salicylic acid. It's mainly contained in medicine or skincare items that relieve trouble. If you take a large amount of it, it may interfere with the growth of your baby. So even if it's just a cosmetic only applied on skin, it's better to be careful. The second ingredient of cushion is retinol. In fact, retinol is known as the best ingredient for wrinkle impairment in the cosmetics industry. But you should be careful during pregnancy. Retinol means vitamin A. But please stop using it during pregnancy because it can interfere with fetal growth. The third ingredient of cushion is aroma oil. When you're pregnant, you'll feel stiff and get a lot of massage, but some aroma oils cause uterine contraction, so you shouldn't get an aroma oil massage. Lastly, parabens, allergens, and pigments used as preservatives are the things you should be careful of course. And these are not good for all skin, even if you're not pregnant. So please, check them out. Today, I talked about healthy home care methods that are safe both for mothers-to-be and baby on the way. How did you enjoy it? When your skin problems increase due to sudden hormonal changes during pregnancy, take care of blemishes and antioxidants with hyperallergenic vitamin C product and sun care. And don't forget to take care of your body as well as moisturizing your skin barrier. And please stop using products with salicylic acid, retinol, and aroma oil 
for the sake of the baby and you. For the healthy skin of all pregnant women who are watching right now, check if the good ingredients and cushion ingredients mentioned are on your table. For healthy and flawless skin of yours, I'll be back soon with more K-Beauty hacks. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Since it's a maternity special, I greet you a little differently. Everyone have a nice baby!